gonna hurt a lot. It's gonna be kind of amazing. What is a no way custard? Is it even still considered custard? Oh, it's backwards. So, we're gonna make this jello nolf. So, nolf is like a custard. It says it contains no eggs. So, I have high expectations for this. Ooh, they have Spanish instructions for Nolf as well. Basic Nolf directions. Two cups of milk is apparently all you need. Caramel sauce packet. Pour into small, four small custard cups or one small bowl. Four half cup servings. Half a cup? Jesus, that is not enough. Nolf for everybody. Stir flan mix into two cups of milk in a small saucepan. Bring to full boil on medium heat. Stir constantly. Mixture will be thin. It's like if they didn't tell you and it was thin, then you just throw the whole thing away. Pour slowly over caramel. Refrigerate for an hour. An hour? Or two hours? To unmold, run small spatula around the edge of each custard. Invert into play <laughs> invert. You know I think of well, if you have to invert something, it's like like if I took this kind of thing, like a Tupperware thing, and I just like fold, like push it and then it folds it inside out and that's inverting it. For best results, use 2% or whole milk. Fat free 1% or evaporated milk can also be- Ew! That means this is just gonna be like powder. <laughs> evaporated milk. Stupid people. Or use a combination of half cup canned sweetened milk and one and a half cups of 2% or whole milk. Wow. How fancy. Alright, so let's start doing this. We have a lot of bowls. None of them are custard bowls. They should, they should be okay, right? Okay. That's four, right? There's supposed to be a packet of Best when used by... No date! This is eternally good. It'll never go bad. Oh, just just like normal Jello. A packet of crap. And then a packet of other crap? For something that doesn't have any egg in it, this smells very eggy. Snip a corner. Oh, god damn it. Eh, eh. Oh, I might not actually have enough for the others. Uh oh. So good at this cooking thing. Look at that. I am I am just amazing at this whole entire distribution deal. I think we should start cooking our stuff. Use like a cauldron. Two cups of milk with this no egg custard. Milk! Can't open the milk. I don't. What? What? The fuck is this? When did I get this? Lift and peel TM. Lift and peel is trademarked by some idiot who thought children wanted to drink milk. I just freaking cut my nails. Like, right before this film. Okay, there we go. This society punishes you if you don't have nails. Cup. Milk. Ooh. One cup of milk. Ooh. Two cups of milk. Okay, that's creamy. So I just turned this fire onto simmer. It concerns me when they say there's no egg in this mixture, and yet the contents are surprising. Ah, are surprisingly yellow, sort of. Ugh. It looks like that cheese, the cheese powder that you get when you make. Mac and cheese. Oh, bring to full boil <laughs> on medium heat. Okay, that's not simmer. Gotta constantly stir it. Like maybe if you don't stir it enough, maybe the egg will come out in the custard and it'll turn into a real custard. Hair down, whip my hair back and forth. In the kitchen, in front of the food, that's gonna be healthy. Cause nothing says delicious like a piece of hair in your dessert. It really looks a lot like cheese. Like really watery cheese. Look at that. Look, look at that. Oh, look. And when it's this kind of yellow, you know it's good. 
which really is what you want to do with your computer. You want to put it on the stove while you cook something on medium heat and it's just getting warm. So I asked some people on Tumblr like what I should do while I was waiting for this stupid thing to go to a roaring boil. You should dance too. What should I dance? Oh, we were just looking at Hoot. Oh, I love it when they put advertisements in front of every video. I don't want to dance at all. Oh, <laughs> absolutely not. There is absolutely no remembrance of how to do anything with that song at all. So at this point, I just don't think my heat's high enough. Because it's kind of been a while. If anything burns to the bottom, I'm gonna be kind of pissed. Oh, oh, bubbles, it's starting to boil. I can fit four and a half cups of flan into my mouth. Maybe I can't. It's boiling. I was too busy answering somebody's question in order to realize how much it was boiling. Turning the fire off. Okay. There's like this yellow gunk, and it's all on the edges. That must be the egg. Okay, so. We have our pot, and it says to pour into each little cup, except I'm a bit of a riri, so we're going to use a little ladle. <laughs> I'm going to let these sit here and cool, because I could really actually burn myself in one of these, and I don't want to put them in my refrigerator. Custard in background. I have not moved that far from the kitchen. That means this video is still legit. So I'm talking about how stupid people are. And I just see the box like this, and I was just like, okay, I'll just open the box like, I'll just open the box like this. So I just open it, and it all just comes out nice and easy. And just now, while I'm reading the instructions, there's this dotted line right here, and I'm like, what's this? So I flip it. It says something in Russian, which I bet says open here. Look. And from the angle I was looking at it, which is like kind of like at their level, I could see like this thin layer of like oil on my eggless custard. What do they have in here? Oh, there's nutrition facts because we're in America and we try to pretend like we care. What? Total fast slash grassa total, which I guess means grease. I don't know. Zero grams. Zero percent. There is absolutely no grease in this stupid thing. And yet I just saw like this oily layer on top. Ah! What did you need to color a syrup? The artificial flavor. Caramel. Caramel's freaking sugar. Why would you? Ah! This is the picture that they have on the stupid thing. And that's two cups of milk. That's what I put in it. Okay, that's cool. What the fuck is that? My amazing Mac camera cannot capture what is in there. But it's like a giant pot of fluffy yellow stuff. You guys saw what was in my pot? That wasn't what was in my pot. Oh my goodness. What is this? You've been seeing me sitting here this whole time. It's almost been, it's, it's two minutes to an hour. So you've seen the stupid bowls just sitting there unless my fat ass was blocking it. But do you see this? I am touching it. I am touching the top of this flan. It has solidified while on my counter. Okay, so it's been... Two days, because I was so busy and I forgot I had this, and I just didn't have time to eat or I wasn't hungry. So this is the flan, and it's all like super cold now. So let's try to eat it. Jiggle. Jiggle, 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 jiggle. 
This is surprisingly good. <laughs> Two thumbs up for this. I'm making this again. This is surprisingly easy and good. Good job, Jello. Good job. If you guys like this kind of video, or if you guys just want me to see me make more food, tell me. So, you guys should go buy this and try this. It's Jello Flan, eggless, but it still tastes delicious. Hmm. Who knew?